What's up everyone? Welcome to a college week in my life midterms edition. I know, I cannot believe it's midterms already. Um, I feel like I was just shooting that first week of classes like college week in my life, which is insane. I know they pushed together the semester so that we could be done before Thanksgiving, but I feel like this is either really early or it's just going by really fast. I don't really know. I'm about to take my intro to media production midterm. Um, I'm actually like okay with this class. If you don't know, my major is TV and film production. So media production, it's like the same thing. Um, and we're just kind of learning what I went to college to learn. So that's why like I'm good with this class. The midterms that I think are gonna be hard is my intro to US history class. I think that's gonna be hard. And then I do have to write an essay tonight for English, which I'm pretty sure is counting as my like midterm, but. All right, so I'm setting up for this midterm now. I think what's gonna happen is she wants us to get on Zoom and then she wants us to turn our cameras off, I guess, and then she's gonna email us the link. I don't really know exactly how it's working out, but um, I'm just gonna get on it, see what she says. Um, I also was supposed to give a presentation today, but I obviously don't think that's gonna happen. Um, wait, where's this link to this class? Okay, one thing, if anyone from Zoom is watching this or your parents work for Zoom, I don't know. Can you ask them if they can, if we can like save phone calls or something in our Zoom? Because how annoying is it that I have to keep typing in this thing to find my Zoom? You know what I mean? Like why can't, I feel like I should just be able to go on and the Zoom's right there. Like just click Zoom and then like pick, okay, call one, call two. Wouldn't that be so much easier? All right, all right, I'm going on now. Um, yeah, wish me luck. All right, so I just finished the test. It went pretty well. I actually did end up presenting, which too went pretty well. Um, I think it's so weird that like literally having midterms online, like if we were in real life, we would have been in a classroom taking this, I don't know. Like, I, this is, we're seven weeks in and I'm still like, I'm literally doing online school. Like I'm still freaked out by it. I mean, it's okay, but you know. So I still have one more class today, but um, it's, it's in like 10 minutes and I have that and then I'm done for the day. Um, something I've noticed about myself is that I don't really get like too stressed about midterms or tests in general. And maybe it's just because i'm like you know like grades or whatever like it is what it is not it is what it is because obviously like we're paying for college like i should be doing well but like at the same time i just feel like i have like the confidence that i'm gonna do well um but i don't know i just don't really stress over midterms i don't i haven't really been overwhelmed at work or anything um i feel like i've just been doing well like i've been hanging out um yeah mm -hmm. but now we have uh, one more class and then done and then normal stuff but as far as like the midterms go for today we're done <laughs> still waiting to get in we have made it into class nothing has happened yet but <sighs> hello guys um so we're done for the day i had that class now i've just been like playing around on my computer not really playing around but like you know just like editing youtube stuff whatever nothing like school related um but yeah, my days, I say, are pretty light compared to what I made it seem like in that first week in my life. And not that I've like made it seem any way, like it really was like that in the beginning. But since then, I have switched my schedule around. Um, some of my classes have just like changed to not meeting every day. Um, so it has changed a little bit. Um, I'll tell you guys about that. So I was really set on taking 18 credits this semester just because I wanted to get some of the more boring classes out of the way while we were online and just kind of take advantage of like being at home and not having like events and stuff to have to go to. So I'm still taking 18 credits and it's been going pretty well. Um, but something that has changed that's been good was my Monday, Wednesday, Friday class that meets from 1010 to 1110 is actually only on Wednesdays. So we don't meet Monday and Fridays. And when we meet on Wednesdays, it's more of like a brief um, meeting. I feel like it's not, it's nothing big. A lot of our work is just like put onto Blackboard and it's like, okay, you have a week to get this done. Um, we do a lot of discussion posts and you have to post on the discussion post like three different times a week so that each day you're going back and you're reading someone's post and you're giving your insight on it. So every single day I am doing something for this class, but because it's smaller, I don't get overwhelmed by it. But I'm also learning and 
this class is called um, stage management so it's like being the manager of like a theater production which is actually pretty interesting and pretty cool um, my English class so my English class we are meeting on Tuesdays and Thursdays and now we only meet on Tuesdays and then we kind of just have like soft deadlines for all the assignments nothing is due when it says it's due it's not due until the end of the semester so I've still been staying on top of my work and you know doing it when the due date is um but yeah that's it for my monday so i had, took my midterm and then um i did have an essay but it's actually not due so good news but yeah that's it for monday so i will see you guys tomorrow do i have a midterm i don't have a midterm tomorrow i don't have anything tomorrow so i'll see you guys tomorrow but no midterm related content tomorrow good morning everyone happy tuesday um I'm really sad to tell you guys that I majorly messed up, like majorly. I mean, okay, maybe not majorly, but like I messed up. I was way too chill yesterday. I knew this essay was due last night at 11.59, but did I do it? No, I didn't. And um, now uh, my entire class is like, let's just hope she gives us an extension. Cause I guess no one in my class did it. But moral of the story, I did not do my homework last night, so. I did do today. This is like the first assignment that I've missed this semester, so it's all good. But I just wanted to give you guys that little update. Um, but I'm hungry now, so. What's the? Um, what time is it? 10:42. Okay, so I have class in about 30 minutes and. In that meantime, I'm just gonna go on Blackboard and look at that essay that I didn't do. Um, and then just look in general, like what assignments I should do, what my grades are looking like. I'm like passing everything with like flying colors, but I just want to make sure that I've been doing all the assignments. Cause I feel like it's so easy to get behind with online classes. So I don't know. I mean, I think I've been doing pretty well with it. Like I was saying, I haven't missed anything yet, but I just wanna double check. See, so this is the essay I haven't done yet. It's basically just taking an essay we already wrote and then like reworking it and reframing it to like match these guidelines It was due last night at 11:59, but it's still open. So I feel like that means probably a soft deadline But yep, i'm just gonna get to work on that for the next 30 minutes and then I will Update you guys when i'm going to class. All right, so this class just started She's just kind of going over like housekeeping stuff for the rest of the um class period, but I honestly didn't do too much of that essay. I was able to add like another paragraph. I have nine paragraphs now and it needs to get to 11. Um, 90, which means Back to the slang position. Um, the class was just long. Um, the class I'm about to go into is long too. I feel like it's harder to sit through online classes that are like hours long. Like that class, it was 11 to 12.30. Now this class is 12.40 to two. Um, I mean, they're not that much longer than a normal period, but I feel like it's easier for me to get through my Monday, Wednesday, Fridays because it's a different class every hour rather than like consecutive hours of the same class, the same thing. But like other than this essay to get done, I really don't have anything to do. Um, as crazy as that sounds because it's midterms, I just, I don't know what's going on. And then the third page should be uh, rough drafts. Now it's time to do actual work. I'm gonna do that essay I keep talking about um, and hopefully get some other work done. It's almost five o'clock. Oh my god, I took oh my god, I took a long ass break. Um, okay, let's just work for like an hour and a half and then we'll get ready for bed. Wait, well, not bed, but like bed, you know, like a night routine. We'll get ready for my night routine. Okay, so I've moved into the kitchen, living room situation. Um, I think I get a lot more done than I do sitting at my desk. Um, but yeah, I finished the essay. I am about to submit it. And then I'm done with school for the day, yay. Perfect. Conversion in progress, yay. Great, perfect.
So that is done and I also did start the midterm that I was telling you guys about earlier. Um, I just made a couple pages on like that website and it was really just like linking work. Like I said, it wasn't gonna take too long. Yeah, this is really good. I think tomorrow's gonna be a busier day because I do actually like have stuff planned that I like have to and need to get done. Um, if you guys are wondering why I never show you what I do at night, so I'm gonna film a night routine, which is why you can't see what I do at night yet, but work is done. We are almost at hump day of midterm week. Yay! Why did I just get woken up to a fire alarm and beeping and yelling and saying, this is a fire, you need to leave the building. Um, puts on some clothes that I found real quick and then stops and they say, never mind. Okay, I'm gonna get ready for real, for real. And I'm ready for now. I have to get this midterm done in like 40 minutes, so I'm gonna go do that real quick. And I just wanted to get, just put some clothes on, wash my face, brush my teeth. Um, but I am actually gonna put on makeup today. I'm actually going to do the whole shebang because we do have to um, record and edit some vids. So we're gonna do that. It is a very jam-packed day, but like we're just gonna go with it. So I'm gonna go take this midterm 40 minutes on the clock. Um, let's hope I finish it. This test opened at midnight last night and it closes midnight tonight and so I have all day like that's cool I'm really glad I have all day and it is 50 questions and then you have two hours to do those 50 questions if I wait to do this during the actual time period I wouldn't be done with this test till like four o'clock and I don't have time to be done with it at four o'clock so I'm just gonna do it now hope I get it done I have 40 minutes to answer 50 questions I feel like I can do it this is intro to US history since 1877 all right here we go. Okay. Woo! So I got a 92 out of 100. Um, pretty good, not gonna lie, especially for this midterm. It was a lot harder than I had assumed it was gonna be. I'm really happy that I did well on it. That's great. Then I have intro to media production, which I'm so excited. I keep like screaming about how I picked the right major, but like it is so true. We are now moving on to like the podcast part of this um, semester. So we're actually meeting with like another professor and she's going to be teaching us about podcasts and maybe i think we're creating one actually which is pretty cool because i have one Go check it out look in the description box i'm pretty happy with today it is only 10 30 and i do have a lot to do today like not gonna lie it is still gonna be a hard day but because i got that test done um and then i'm gonna go do my makeup i will have already like knocked out like majority of what was stressing me out so we're good all right makeup is complete i changed into this like tank top shirt or whatever um i have to film an intro to a video that's going up tomorrow so we're gonna do that what time is it it's 10 57 so i have class in like 13 ish minutes so i can film this intro in like five minutes get that out of the way grab a snack log on to class and we are good to go i feel like it's still early for what I have to do like when I get out of this class it'll be like what 12 30 and then I have time to go grocery shopping I have time to finish editing I have time to maybe film another video so I just feel really good about what we have done right now I'm currently setting up my tripod okay we are waiting for the class to start oh it's about to connect I have my grapes um well today has just been great that class got out almost an hour early which is crazy but I'm not complaining. I'm actually really happy about this. Um, I'm sure you guys are watching this and you're like, how is this midterm week? Like, how is she so chill? Um, I just honestly don't have much work this week. I feel like this happened to me last year though. Like I was like, oh my God, it's about to be like my first midterms week, oh my God. And like, I always heard everyone talking about it, but then I got to midterms week and I was like, I barely have anything. And like, you know, I know there's people that are struggling like with their week, but I feel like um, this hasn't been bad for me, so it's practically Friday. Like, practically Friday, right? Because it's Wednesday. So it's pretty much Friday, which means it's the weekend. We have made it back. The weather was very nice. Um, uh, there's nothing in there, if you couldn't see. Two things of pizza. This one is the Italian cheese board, and this one is just the four cheese rising crust. For normal people, we like pizza. Um, I got a pack of English muffins. I eat these every morning, and I didn't have one today, but English muffins. 
I got a, another thing of milk because we ran out. This is just the vanilla almond milk. That's the best one to me. I got a thing of orange juice. Also, um, this was like way too expensive, but it was just a pumpkin spice latte from Starbucks. Like they're like bottled coffee or whatever. I really was not going to get this, but I was like, I have to try it. And I don't really have any um, coffee pods left, so I feel like that'd be good. Then I got a thing of blackberries. These are my favorite fruit. Then I got the small bites, macaroni and cheese, like ball bite things. Then I got two things of fries. This is the seat waffle, like seasoned. And then these are the rosemary fries. These are probably the best thing you will ever find at Whole Foods. Like seriously, you guys have to go try these. They taste like smash burger fries, but like better quality. You need to wipe it down, put it in the fridge. And then um, I'm gonna eat lunch and hang out on the couch. So I'll check in with you guys in a couple hours when I get back to working. Well, hello everyone. This has just been the best day ever. So it is now 4.45 and I've just been working this entire time. I was able to edit and upload a video. I was able to FaceTime Delaney and outline the podcast for tonight. I, um, what else did I do? I was able to work on my essay for English. Um, I did my whole topic for like my podcast assignment. So, you know, I got a lot done. So I'm really happy with today. Like I said, it's only 4.45. So now I'm going to have the rest of the day to do whatever I want. Um, only one more day of midterms. Thursday, tomorrow, we have one test and then we're done. Then midterms week is complete and I will have survived it. And I will have passed all my tests with flying colors because I'm speaking it into existence. So yeah, I'm really happy about this. But I was about to end the video be like, but all my socials will be right here on the screen. I meant to say, but I'll see you guys in the morning. All right, um, that's it for Wednesday. Good morning, everyone. Happy Thursday. It's Thursday, right? Um, one test today, one class today. Then we're done with midterms. I know it's not Friday, but Friday I don't have anything. Like, no tests, no assignments. Like, we're just, we're done. Um, but I do feel like I need to tell you guys about the best drink that I've come across. So, remember yesterday, I said that I wanted this, but I was so hesitant, but I just bought it anyway. Well, 99 point, it was really scary. My English mouth was done. 99.9% .9 sure this is my favorite drink. Okay, so here's the recipe, and I feel like you guys should write this down because I'm telling you, life changing. So first, start with a cup of ice. I guess you could do hot too, but I haven't tried hot. The hot, the ice just does it for me. Shake it up. This is the pumpkin spice latte, iced espresso from Starbucks. It says flavored with other natural flavors, and it says spicy and sweet, and I can tell you that it's true. Um, and fill it to like right here. You'll, I'll show you. Oh shit, it's a little much. I mean, I love Starbucks, especially in the fall. I really want to try a chai tea latte with cinnamon double che and pumpkin spice cold foam, but I'm holding off. I think when I go back to New York, I will try it. Maybe. We'll see. Then take vanilla almond milk. Specifically from Khalifa or Khalifia Farms. I don't know exactly, but something about this milk. I think it's just very sweet. Love this one. So take like a dash, maybe a little more than that. Take Nestle Coffee Mate French Vanilla Sugar Free Creamer. And again, just like a dash. Great. Handful of sugar for the part that makes it good. Take a straw, preferably bamboo. It doesn't have to be, but that's what I like, and mix it up. Look. It's a little hard. There we go. 10 out of 10 recommend. Guys. So it tastes like a very light coffee. It's like light, very light. And then you get the pumpkin at the end. It's just good. But thank you for coming to my TED Talk. Time to eat breakfast, time to relax, and then we have a quiz in one hour, so. Cheers, yay! <laughs> I've said this already, but I just wanna say it again. I know this week was not a typical midterms week. It just wasn't like that. I think I just go into it with the idea of like, it's, you have to do it, you know what I mean? You 
there's no there's no way out of it so it's just like just take the test get on with it but i will say this was um a lot less work than i had intended for it to be but i'm getting on to zoom now and this video is actually coming to a close is that sad or what guys guys oh my god <laughs> i'm just kidding i'm literally being so dramatic um we made it we did it midterms are complete are you guys happy or what are you proud of me i got through this week i know for a fact i got a 90 and above on every single midterm i took the test i just took it was only 10 questions 10 questions so unless i got two or three wrong like i'm good yes but that my friends is gonna bring me to the end of this video so if you guys enjoyed this little week in my life midterms week edition we did it we got through it it wasn't as bad as it was thought it was gonna be but nonetheless i'm happy i'm excited to be done so i will catch you guys in my next video all my socials will be right here on the screen as well as in the description box down below i post every tuesday thursday and sunday at 12 o'clock and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on any uploads but i will see you guys on tuesday all right bye